Cool, cool. All right. Welcome back to Fate. This is, again, session, session 27. This is number five of this session. The branch of the old Shvalik Road leads to the vineyard. You're kind of approaching through the like along that road. After a half mile, the road becomes a muddy trail that meanders through the woods, descending gradually until the trees part, revealing a mist-shrouded meadow. Guys, is there the trail really splits. Water? One path leads west into the valley, and the other leads south That's into dark of wood. Question. Wooden signpost at the intersection points west and reads Vineyard. You're, of course, heading that way. Uh, a light drizzle begins to fall. Unpainted fences blindly follow the trail, which skirts north of a sprawling vineyard before bending south toward a stately building. The fog takes on ghostly forms as it, as it swirls between the neatly tended rows of grapevines. Here and there, you see rope-handled half barrels used for hauling grapes. North of the trail is a large stand of trees. A man wearing a dark cloak and cowl stands at the edge of the trees, beckoning you. <laughs> beckoning! <laughs> beckoning! <laughs> do you know, do, Vlad, do you know anything about this, this vineyard or who that guy might be? What, what you want, bro? <laughs> I want to yell over at the guy, hey, yes. what, what's up? Hey, you girl, would. Hey. You yeah. would know. I actually want to yell, hey, girl, hey. <laughs> Uh, but, sounds about but, right. Yeah. But only it's an that that it that appears to be. Let's see. Do you approach or do you continue to the? Do Do I know Do I know who it is? You wouldn't know. Let's see. Hang on. You know what? Fuck it. I'll walk over to him. Yeah. Okay. About the Bob, yeah. Be thank awesome. You, thank you. I'm gonna walk over there, Jerry. Let's see what he wants. Okay. <clears throat> yes. You I'm would actually... know this 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 individual. Ah. Um. And as you approach, eight other figures step out. They are all wearing dark leather ring cloaks and cowls. Now you know these because you're you happen to be one. Um, this is a group of. And you can't tell it offhand, but you would know. This is a group of werewolves. Oh! Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to give a complicated calling sound as a greeting. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what is he doing back there? <laughs> What's, What's going Where on? Where did they come from? <laughs> oh, no, I'm walking over to them, by the okay. way. Okay. Nagri, stop! Yeah. Nagri, uh, stop. Why? They're like me. Okay. They, no. <laughs> That's not gonna do anything. <laughs> They're not bad people. They're all. Good. They were saying, "Come <laughs> over." I mean, I'm going to go over and see what's up. One of them who like, they were all pretty heavily cowled, so you can't really make out a lot of the features. But one of them kind of steps forward and pulls back the the cowl and introduces himself as Davian Martikov. Damian. D A V I. And I, I roll to see if I. I'm gonna flap up and yeah. jump in front of everybody else. Greetings, Davian! Greetings! Okay, I'll let you go. That's rude, just jump in front of everyone. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna punch Nagri in the face. What just brings you here? <laughs> we are going to wire! Let's throw another riot. <laughs> okay, most of you probably don't remember this from last session, because it's been a little while. But you're actually tasked by Erwin. Uh, the owner of the Blue Inn, the Blue River Inn, the Blue, whatever the hell that inn was called. Because wine Blue shipments water. and stuff. Blue, uh, water. Blue Water Inn. Because the wine shipment has not arrived yet. Oh, yeah. Now, Davian is the owner of the winery. Of the winery, yes. So, so I'll, I'll tell him. We, we, we come to check on shipment for Blue Water Inn. Hmm. It has not arrived. Okay, I see. Who sent you? The owner of Blue Water Inn. Oh, Erwin. Erwin. That dude. <laughs> that, that, <laughs> that, that, that dude. That one. <laughs> that one. That one. <laughs> oh my gosh. What? Uh, he has good vodka. Yes, he does. Oh. 
Ooh. very much like his old guy. Rainer. I got better vodka. You're amazing. I have er, potato. Er, <laughs> Erwin, Erwin Martikov. This is space actually, kids. Uh, yeah, he's actually a, a relative of Damien. Holy Shit. fucking hell. What is that? It's a, it's a super Beastly awesome Rainer. Rainer. It's a <laughs> mean Rainer. It's a motherfucker. Because it Dirty works that way. On. It's amazing. Well... We are, and and they're they're actually not any. They're they're close to the building, but not really. We had some of our um, people. Some of our ma <laughs> our magic seeds have been stolen. <laughs> they're called seeds in quotes. Uh, he describes them. They're actually um, gems. <laughs> they're they were gems <laughs> about the size of pine cones. Pretty, pretty, pretty large gems. Um, each one containing a glowing green light as bright as a torch. Uh, for the good of Orberovia, I urge you to travel to Berez and Yester Hill to retrieve two of them. He has. She has no idea what happened to the third one. These gems <sighs> help us grow the grapes and in, in this sort of desolate area. Can I give a whip? I'm going to say something if you need help growing some grapes. I got you. Oh, well, I don't think you plan on living here for he the rest of your life. He's druid, though. No, true. but I can give you true. a nice head start real fast while we go off on this adventure. This is true. So you can have some wine waiting when we come back. Okay. Okay. There are, um, by the way, with, within, this, within, within this group of nine people, there are some, sh some are obviously women based on their, their shape. <laughs> Of the cloaks, at least. and there are uh, several children. I know I saw children somewhere. <laughs> ah, me too. <laughs> 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 Those uh, bastards. Man. Those motherfuckers. Well, I, I'm glad they did not get harmed by a crazy demon. Oh man. Yeah. It wasn't even that bad. It's going kind of funny, man. Uh, just it's throwing that offer out there. If you want some help, head to start growing no. your grapes. While we go off, I can do that yeah, real fast. I should take a better notes. So, mm -hmm. we totally need to get one of those. And... Mm. Is that what we came for? It's one of the things we came for. We oh. also need a cast of the finest one. And they can't make any more well, either. Okay. We need the good gems. Yeah. Are these back here? And they're missing Hang on. They don't know what happens. I gotta get. So if they don't I gotta gather some info. Sorry, guys. Exactly. I should go investigate to see if I can find clues they did not. Exactly. Are they in here? Why though? I guess maybe we they need to are it. probably not. Like, maybe they have some oh. laying around. There's no more of it. Balls. We need. That works. We need. Well, it's native. Maybe the woods. Not what I need. Ah. That. So That's hey, later. hey, Yo. hey, Mr. Uh, Mr. Martikov. Oh, that is yes. that is one that is uh, Blue Water Man. No, that's the no. no they're both Martikovs. Yeah, oh, yeah. Davian, Makes everything Davian and Erwin Martikov. They are uh, so. So, ones. Mr. Martikov, this uh, these grapes. Do they make a like? It's a special one. Yes. Like Does yes. that also use uh, a special cask of any sort? Um, besides maybe like a special sort of you wood mean, or... No, or no, I mean we sort of we have uh, within the building there are four casks. Three of them are filled with wine at the moment. Anyway. Okay. Um, so you guys, just make, you guys just make I one type find of wine. Correct? Hmm? You got, there's just one type of wine you guys make. I'm new yes. here. I, I'm an yes. alcohol connoisseur, so I'm just Actually, <laughs> making sure there's have a some name. Wine. Give me one second. Uh, I'm going to try a sample wine. of this wine. Blood wine. Make it blood wine. There are... Blood grape wine. There are some wines w. in there. There's, just, there's like not a number there. Barrel Maker's Workshop, blah, blah, blah. Barrel Storage. Hang on. I'm going to find it. Well, 
Also, if you don't mind, um, some individuals have, while we are out here, they've kind of taken over the winery. Um, it's a problem. Yes. Oh, let's, well, let's go clear that out real fast, guys. What kind of relationship do I have with other Were Ravens since I'm not Lawful Good? <sighs> they are. Um, you are actually familiar with the group. They are a part. <laughs> they're all members of a group that is called uh, Keepers of the Feather. I have the smallest feather tokens around there. Oh. Okay. Out <laughs> outside of that, you don't really like. You don't really interact a lot with them. You know that they're good people, and that's pretty much it. And I know I left them a long time ago. Yes, yes, you did. The well, you did good if you look this small. Wine cellar. Where What's is the wine cellar. I need just strongest <laughs> wine. <laughs> My wine is too strong for you, traveler. Oh, ho, 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 ho! <laughs> <laughs> oh, ho. <laughs> oh, my gosh. All right. So, you have a couple of different directions that you can go. That you need I to say go. we clear out the winery, mm. then go look for seats. I'm, I'm down with clearing out the winery. I'm just always down for a battle. We need, we need to go to the winery and take Stop wine. talking so loudly, they can hear you. <laughs> <laughs> No, 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 you, you may have wine. Oh, yeah. We have much wine. Okay. <laughs> get too uh, much wine. I love how that's your main concern. <laughs> We're about to go kill someone, you're like, whoa, we but wine. <laughs> we need the winery clear. Okay, so yeah, we, we got that, don't worry. Before we do that, Evan and I were mm -hmm. talking about doing a tinkering check for explosive arrows. Yeah, since I, I can craft weapons and whatnot. What are you making... Uh, or at least to learn it, learn the, the ability to make it. Uh, well, it's certainly it's possible. Powder. It's only possible to make. Uh, and we'll say that you, because of your gunslinger mode, we'll say that you have uh, some gunpowder. So hypothetically, you could make some explosive arrows. Just like, like a handful or something. But you also need, like, you don't have. Any of the equipment here to actually construct the the heads for the arrows to create them, but that is certainly something that you can create because going of forward. the gun. Yeah, yeah. All right, sweet. I just want to make sure if we can do it now, it'd be fun. <laughs> right. Sneak attack with an explosive arrow. Right, right. Don't worry, my uh, um, uh, rifle has explosive shots. That's amazing. <laughs> Give me one of those. Can I tie cards, one of please? those bullets oh, to an arrow? It's price. actually my oh, red. That's it. Ow. It's a charge. It's a little. Yo. Okay. I wrote really bad notes because now I'm really confused on what we need. I'm pretty sure I know what we need one thing of. My power is strength, the sword of sunlight. I just wrote cask, minus one, no more drink. Are we trying to get a cask? Uh, the wine. You'll have to tell me about the other thing. We, uh, uh, I think, I think we okay. figure that one out. Where, where you are at the present for your quest for gathering stuff? There's this, two things we get. Yeah, here. yeah. Uh, well, no. I'm pretty sure I've learned about one thing, but there's one thing I can get here. There's only one. Only one thing to get here. Okay. The other things you need are in uh, Kresk and a couple of other places. I think we'll get to go to the Bear Ends. What is... I don't have that on hand. Uh, sounds three right. of coins. Yeah, three of what? Three, three of coins? coins? Three, <laughs> three of coins. Three of coins. Uh, okay, so that one is... It says, look to the Wizard of Wines. In wood and sand, the treasure hides. Wood and sand. Yeah. Why would one have a need sand? Filtration. Well, sand. we'll we'll get to that. The we'll know get that, to that. Just stupid. Everybody. I think it's a missing the thing. Like, I think we should just go clear out this. So you are approaching. Yeah, I'm, I'm totally going to go clear out this winery. Yeah, that's, you, that's you want to go in? Approaching the winery. 
I really great, think great. we need to keep it. All right. I'm going to go for a second story entry. Situated in the midst of the vineyard, the winery is an old two-story stone building with multiple entrances. Thick ivy covering every wall and iron fencing along its roof line, the trail ends at an open loading dock on the ground floor. A wooden stable of more recent construction is attached to the east side <coughs> of the winery. If you're looking on the map here, it's that it's like W1 okay. over there. That's where we enter. Uh, well, so that's, that's, that's okay. Kind of, okay. 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 That's well. That's that's almost nice like an outbuilding, if, mm -hmm. if you will. Mm -hmm. um, west of the winery is a crumbling well and a wooden outhouse. Let's get everybody standing. Uh, well, okay. So technically speaking, this is all open space as is that back there. So like this is just like multiple floors of the same building, right? So this is the ground floor. This is the front of the building. So you would probably be on kind of in, 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 in this area. If you want to stand everybody up there. Cool as you <laughs> Cool. Good job, guys. <laughs> it's hard to reach. I mean, yeah. if you guys yeah. want to clear this winery out by yourself, that's as, okay. As you approach the winery building, <laughs> you hear, yeah. you hear the, just facing the wrong way. So you hear the so rustle. Which way are we going? Dead vines all around. <laughs> you. People. Oh, in human shapes emerge from the vineyard. Their limbs crackling as they trudge forth through the mist and rain. More I'm getting on the roof. <laughs> All right. Can you move your character sheet, Isaac Schmidt? Yes. They're going to be coming around that way. I'm actually going to go invisibly. Invisibly? Oh. Okay. Can you, do you have greater invisibility or just <coughs> less? I just have lesser. Damn. Um, you'll swag. <laughs> I use. Yeah, Can I, I do a perception check? Or would it, be, like would it not better. be useful? Just to say greater would be nice because just I go visible too. Mm -hmm. Sneak attack from all sides. That's not a good idea. <laughs> Sneak attack for days. I'm trying to see what they look like or try to determine what they are. Look at all them yos. Hey, this is this is heaven for imps. All the yos. All the yos. Mm -hmm. Five. Six. Put them over here. These are little, they're called needle blights. Oh no. Oh yeah. I hate blights. Blights. And they wouldn't have fire. Uh, Imps has fire? Nine. I mean, like, fire bolt. Uh, Imps has something like that. There's a bunch of them. Imps has grenades, Imch, which uh, we already Three, used all of, but Imps also does have, uh, six, I can shoot a line of fire out of your swag. 20 foot line. Can be useful. Yes. All right. Fire elemental. Please don't do that. If I can do it. As okay. soon as Bolina sees this, she's going to slam her fists together mm -hmm. and fire elemental her hands. Dope. Okay. We're Here's the thing. winery on fire. <laughs> Please don't bring no. the winery down. No. Okay. <laughs> That's a. I'm invisible. That's gonna be a key. No. It's a key no, element. No, we need this no. watery to survive. The no. Key element. Um, so I'm just gonna put the plant somewhere up guys. on a corner here. He's on the roof. All right. That's fine. Fifty foot swat, fly speed. He can go up. Oh. That sounded good. Sorry. Right. Uh, pardon the earthquake. Tommy, let me fix the camera. Oh wait, no, you're good. You, you pointed at that. We're good. Yeah, I already did it. Yeah. Uh. 30 needle blights emerge from the surrounding vineyard and make their way towards you and the winery. Technically speaking, they're 120 feet away when they first become visible. So you have a couple of choices here. You can stay and fight, which I'm sure is going to be what Imch wants to do. This is what Slav wants to do. Or you can barricade yourself inside the winery. We can't destroy the water. Well, so we can, should not use point. explosives. We can't use explosives because we cannot we destroy could, the water. We could set up a choke point. Yeah. Is there? Is oh, Imps likes kill zones. Where's the entrance? Okay, where, where that is an excellent scared. question. 
I mean, uh, I don't mind just get, I, because, I, I'm okay with getting in the middle of all of them. I'm totally invisible. Just go on, I have game deep. plan, and I'm not telling anybody what it is. So, W5 right there. Okay. Is a veranda. I love that kind of uh, That's a good coffee. Yeah. You're, okay, so, um, Vlad is actually chalk. on top of the veranda's roof. Okay. It's kind of open. The little, um, circles around that are columns and sitting within that there are three three five foot diameter wooden tubs their insides stained with grape juice uh, each tub has a short ladder bolted to its side and a catch basin tucked underneath uh, at the back of the veranda is a large set of sliding wooden doors as well as a normal sized wooden door you can see both of those doors right there. Yeah. Uh, what, back here? Yeah, yeah those. Yep. So, uh... On the other, kind of further down, where the orange wagon is there, that's just kind of an open space as well. And then W3, there's a door into that from, from the outside. I don't want them getting inside the winery. Yeah, we gotta protect it. So, Imsh, we might need you to go out there and, you know, kill them. I have an idea. Oh, yeah? We set cart on fire and roll it into them. Oh, well, are we, it's a winery man. Cart, the cart's a pretty good sized cart. I mean, Imsh, Imsh could probably move it because he's a monster. But, uh. Do you want to burn the cart, though? I don't know that you, that you would no. want to burn, burn the cart. If possible, don't destroy any of them. <laughs> Try to leave everything intact. Yeah. I take it my Raven buddies hear this and say, Stop it! No! <laughs> yeah. First thing that we're going to do, because you can see them way before they actually this get is, anywhere this is, close. This is, this is Miranda. It's, it's just it's, ground, ground floor. It's, floor yeah. It, it is, it's, it's essentially open space. I'm, I, it, my invisible self is... You're going in? I'm going to actually go to this... All right. This back well, this what we're going to do is we're going to do initiative. Oh boy. That's where I want to position this. I'm just going to stand up there firing arrows off at them. Pick them off. Cool. Right. We're going to need initiative. Before rolls. we start, one transform <laughs> into a giant scorpion. Oh, okay. That's pretty dope. Do, okay. do you have one of those? Huh? Do you yeah. have a giant scorpion? Yeah. I do not have a giant scorpion. We can use a cat. No. I have gargantuan though. Yeah. Or colossal. I mean, the closest thing I have, I mean, it's like size wise. I love that dragon. Mm. I don't really see a giant scorpion being like that. I feel like it'd be like people size. Well, no. A giant scorpion is large. Large. We're going to use this. Technically, it's a drider, but we're going to use oh, this see, that's for, good. for size. That's good, yeah. For size purposes. This is Dean and Doe Erden, for those of you who know what that is. Mm -hmm. I don't know who that is. Uh, I got it. Yeah. You are now a giant scorpion. Boop. Uncle Boo here. Also a lady spider. So is this all oh open? God. This is all open. Uh, these aren't rooms. Those are rooms. This it's not entirely open. Oh. Just just over you five. Just brother. Is actually open. A lady spider. And then the rest of it is like building. All right. Walls and stuff. Yeah. Uh, now they're 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 a little out. I need everyone to roll initiative, please. And we're just going to go around the table at this point. Uh, oh, yay. But, oh, dude, there are That's so cool. many enemies here. It's ridiculous. So. Are they outside the winery? They're outside the winery, yeah. They were, they they were, were, they were actually, like, amongst the vineyard. They were in the vineyard, and they're making their oh, way. Oh, that's not good. We're going to need the druid to clear that part up. And, cause and they're making bad. their way out. Um, I clear up the vineyard. Let's kind of go around you mean here. Like make the vineyard clean with, again. Yes. Purify the plants. Uh, mm -hmm. Alright, can I rethin turning into a the giant scorpion? 20 is blood. 13, you say? For Belena. Is Belena. As you said. Oh, fucking 9. 9. <laughs> Okay. 26 Ravender. Good lord. I initiative 9. Yeah. Damn, you got the alert feed on that? Uh, no, it's, no the, it's, uh, a, it's a gunslinger thing. 
and ten for Psy. <laughs> ten. Because I'm four. still last. Oh, God, seven. Seven. Yes. No, that is seven. Last. That's time. I always go last. That is seven. time. All right, seven. we're gonna we're gonna get this kind of set up, and we'll be right back later. <laughs> <laughs>